Now to a developing story, Toshiba and Western Digital have agreed in principle to settle their legal dispute over the sale of Toshiba's flash memory business. Toshiba had agreed to sell that division to a Bain Capital-led consortium for $18 billion. We're going to have more for you on that story a bit later in the show. There's going to be a call in about 30 minutes. We're going to continue uh, to bring you all the details. But first, I want to bring in Matt Larson of Bloomberg Intelligence for more. So, Matt, as we understand it, we knew they were reaching a settlement, but now we know the terms of that settlement. Walk us through those terms. Uh, thanks, Emily. I actually haven't had a chance to take a look at all the exact terms. They're still coming out. Um, essentially, Western Digital's SanDisk was uh, disputing that uh, Toshiba had the adequate rights in order to sell interest in a joint venture between Western Digital and Toshiba. Uh, they had been in litigation in California State Court. They'd been in uh, arbitration proceedings um, that were set to conclude in the first quarter of next year, um, right around the same time as the sale needed to be completed. And so it was in both companies' best interest to bring this lawsuit to a close, uh, and it looks like they were able to reach a deal. Uh, the the details of that deal are being uh, are being leaked now. It had been rumored over the past couple of weeks that the companies were uh, were getting close to uh, to some kind of agreement. So uh, it looks like the agreement was approved. The lawyers have been able to draft up um, legal documents memorializing uh, the deal, and so uh, both companies, I think, will be uh, will be better off in putting this dispute behind them. What is the significance of this in the context of a rapidly consolidating chip business to potential big takeovers looming Qualcomm NXP Broadcom and Qualcomm is there a relationship here you know, I think there, there's a lot going on in the semiconductor industry. Like you said, there's consolidation. Uh, a lot of companies are looking at where they're going to secure supply, how those supply chain relationships are going to be um, are, are going to be consolidated, whether they're going to be secure. Uh, for Western Digital, this is uh, certainly a big uh, a big deal in in uh, in securing their chip supply into the 2020s. Um, Western Digital and Toshiba have been collaborating on on a number of different fabs that do uh, output of various memory chips. And so um, right now you're seeing a lot of jockeying and companies trying to trying to figure out where their next generation chips are going to be manufactured, what these pairings look like, uh, whose technology is going into the chips, and then most importantly, who's actually manufacturing the semiconductor uh, in the silicon.